You want to separate out one first. You can try to separate one egg. And it's easier to also people running a uh, incubator program. But maybe we should also put some water. Find out yeah, 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 yeah. to oh, yeah. uh, reflect on the paper you've written. Uh, it's a big uh, science center, and there's also big laboratory people come over and do biology work. Is that possible? How about this green growing plant plant scene? This is a do-it-yourself uh, tissue culturing plant lab. Is this considered do-it-yourself bio or not? You can have it organized. Uh, it's it's like, tattoo work shop. Like, is this <laughs> term? The egg tattoo work shop. Actually, we use the whole thing. Yes, this one. If you're in society. Uh, and the first question I asked her was, do you think the EU actually has a role in this? That does the EU actually have to support this? Well, Luckily, he said yes. <laughs> well, if he said no, so, then he just do it. Yeah. 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 That's a good thing. Not always you know, explicit. Uh, I like this machine. I like this machine. For example, like that machine. Code, I think some of them are uh, represented. But, you know, to me, this code of ethics is really typical institutionalization of well, ethics instead of that. Yeah. practice of ethics. Yeah, practice yeah, of ethics. Yeah, well, um, at well, the really level, so there's a it's very much concerned about this. It's also a research and innovation project. That's where that would fit in. So if you do it yourself, buy out, what is the right Practicing a new way of ethics. Of course, we're also selling it around. Uh, so <laughs> here we go. What he did is was compliant, risk management, all these things because they cannot. If one EU project yeah. is corrupted, then everybody in the whole Europe will be upset about it. If somebody takes a million project without having a project, 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 project. Especially in the creative project, the more open and creative project, project projects get. So, for example, Horizon 2020 has less requirements on reporting than the Creative Europe programs. Roto. The Creative Europe programs are supposed to be artists and more designers. Oh, you just and broke it. I just smashed them on it there. The amount of yeah. electricity that you used during your event to show that you actually turned on the lights and that you actually had a micro injector. Yeah. It goes to that level. Of course, for SMEs, the whole kind of thing. Of course, there have been small amounts of Eurostars, Sigma Tars, and all these other types of mechanisms. Those are for business innovation, not for hackers uh, or other types of innovation and social innovations. So, right, you're right, this is the most interesting. Yeah, you know, had this uh, chess, chess program before for social innovation. Yeah, it's like a business program. Uh, yeah. How about if we give this <laughs> very burdensome thing that I noticed in the project? No, I'm, I actually have some phobia of GMOs, I actually do. Like, I don't think that we know the effect of the, them on the environment itself. So then helping people get over the fear of something that may be an environmental hazard, is that good or is that, uh, is that okay or is that not okay? Yeah, I mean, in Europe, of course, we have to support the in the nation, so it's trying to prevent that from happening. But if it has morally right or wrong, to have a precautionary principle, yeah. <laughs> it's difficult to for me to judge, I would say. That's a different thing, yeah. You don't know it's such a thing work. Nice. That's right. Uh, biohacking has been kind of uh, hijacked by kind of uh, some really biology. We kind of love to do the to do the engineering, that's what we're doing. And that's the only questions that we're trying to answer. So I, I think we really are to really use this tool for that kind of uh, the narratives of science is kind of technical things, so uh, which is genetic engineers are out of it. This is it is the questions that we are actually answering when we're sitting in discussion it was much more kind of uh, is this water healthy? Can I kind of grow my own herbs in my garden if the soil is toxic? It's much more kind of just uh, connecting with the environment. So I think we really need to reflect on that aspect and kind of break out of that narrative. And because otherwise we then constantly allow ourselves into discussions that we've got kind of fear we didn't want to be because this is a college.